Hi, my name is Dr. Justine Lee, and I'm an emergency critical care veterinary specialist and toxicologist. And today, I wanted to talk about something called gastric dilatation volvulus, or GDV. This is most commonly called bloat. And it's important for pet owners to know about this because bloat is a life-threatening surgical emergency. In other words, you need to get to the vet or an emergency vet immediately if you notice the signs of GDV. So, what are the signs of bloat? Well, classic signs are if your dog wakes you up in the middle of the night, your dog is really agitated and panting, your dog is retching and trying to vomit, but very little is coming out, if you notice that your dog's abdomen is really distended, or if you notice that the rib cage seems really what we call sprung and really distended, if your dog's heart rate is racing, those are all signs of bloat and you need to get to a vet immediately. Now bloat is seen more commonly in large breed dogs. So dogs like Great Danes, Irish Wolfhounds, Standard Poodles, German Shepherds. So if you have any of these breeds, talk to your veterinarian about what tips you can do to potentially minimize the risk of bloat. There's actually a surgery we can do called a gastropexy, where we basically staple the stomach to prevent the stomach from twisting and becoming a life-threatening bloat. We usually will do this when we're spaying a dog. So if you have a Great Dane or one of these large breed dogs, we do recommend a preventative gastropexy when they're six to nine months of age at the time of spay. So talk to your veterinarian about it. We know that Great Danes in America have about a 50% chance of developing bloat. It's a very expensive surgery and it's an emergency surgery that needs to be performed. So when in doubt, talk to your veterinarian about it on what you can do to prevent it and know what signs to look for so you can get your dog to a veterinarian right away for life-saving surgery. Mm -hmm.